Hi and welcome to this video. It's my first video in a couple of weeks because I've been on holiday so I thought I'd uh, make a quick video on blue screens of death. Now there is a little program you can use called blue screen view that will allow you to read these blue screen files, mini dump files that are actually put on your system when you get a blue screen of death like so. So you can actually get the actual program from this location here. I will actually put this link in uh, my uh, description or on my server you can actually download the program it's a handy little program to have if you uh, do a lot of fixing of computers and it allows you to read the mini dump files without doing a lot of hassle of setting up um, a program to read these crash dump files so you can get it from this site here and download it as I said and uh, let's have a little look at the actual files themselves and the program running itself. So I'm going to show you where the actual mini dump files will be dumped. I'm going to your windows and you can see a folder called mini dump. Inside there you'll have your dump files. Now these are encrypted so you can't just right click and, and look at the uh, information on notepad or nothing like that. You need to read them uh, with a special program. Now Microsoft do have this program but it's a bit hassle of getting symbols and stuff like that as you can see in some of my previous videos but with this little program that we're going to download and use this is the program here, I'm going to show you it now it's called Blue Screen View it's a tiny little program as you can see now I've dragged all that into a folder into my C drive and I've put it inside a Blue Screen View as you can see Okay, so as soon as I click on this it's going to show us the actual dump files that are in here it reads them automatically so if I click on that now you can see it's reading these four dump files that I've got here and it shows me the error message what they are which is really really useful so if you have a look in here now you can see um, the first one is actually sometimes it doesn't show you this message and tell you what file has caused it but in this case it has it's told me it's the uh, ATI um, ATR file which is a DLL file there this calls the uh, blue screen it's also um, you can give the actual stop message this is the actual stop code down here now you can actually google these if you wanted to there's plenty of sites out there that read stop messages that have got an actual you can actually just google this part if you wanted to or, or the whole lot but normally it gives you some information okay so uh, that's that one and uh, as you can see there's a uh, few others there, win32k.sys and the how DLL which is a common one okay and it gives you the actual stop code there, a stop message there and the actual stop code okay so as I said handy little uh, tool to actually read these programs the options inside here are pretty uh, straightforward really there's nothing major you can view change change the actual um, panel and it will actually take the blue screen off the bottom okay so it will actually change it as you can see but um, I left it on the blue screen view okay so anyway I hope this has been some use for you download it give it a go it's pretty handy for technicians that want to quickly read dump files this is Brian from brightech.co.uk any questions please leave a comment Show your support, subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. Any requests, send me a message and I'll do my best to do them for you. Thanks very much.